Hello everyone and welcome to the very first Women and Worth Virtual Summit. I want to start by saying a huge thank you to you for being part of this community. Many thanks to those of you that joined <coughs> yesterday and a warm welcome to those of you who are joining for the first time today. If there is anything that the past six months has taught us, community is essential in lifting each other and helping support each other both in our professional and personal lives, which have become all the more entwined as so many of us have integrated work into our homes or had to make difficult decisions as we adjust to the new environment that we're now all living in. <clears throat> Over this three days, we're exploring how life has changed following the past six months and discussing why now more than ever, it's important that we power forward together. Building on the fantastic speakers that we had yesterday where we covered what the landscape looks like right now for investing in women and minorities, women in politics, using your mission to innovate, why women are key to the UN Sustainable Development Goals and the transformation of work. Today we'll be discussing and sharing ideas on the importance of self-reflection, how we can activate progress for women, advancing your career through self-advocating, how to thrive in a male-dominated industry, as well as how to get on a board. We also have our member session this evening at 5 p.m. ET on the importance of financial empowerment with a performance from singer and composer Layla Adu. So if you're interested in becoming a Women and Worth member, please either email us at communityatworth.com um, or also you can subscribe on worth.com uh, homepage if you just press the um, subscribe button. Our aim is to give you, our community, the opportunity to learn, share, be inspired, uh, be supported, and connect with our attendees and speakers who forged ahead during this tumultuous time to continue their work to impact change, to lead with purpose and overcome some of the systemic barriers that are still holding women and minorities back from access to pay, access to jobs, promotion, board positions, wealth accumulation and capital. Before we get started, I'd like to say a huge thank you again to our partners. Thank you to UBS. Um, thanks to Sharon Sager, David Siriani, Chris Amo, Jamie Sears and the team. Uh, we'll be hearing from Jamie and Sharon today. Many thanks to Indeed, uh, to Carmen Bryant, um, and also to Chris Hines, who uh, was interviewed by Kate Luzio yesterday. Thank you to LG Signature uh, and to Michelle Acosta Donovan, their Director of Sponsorships and Events, and also to New Music USA, all who saw uh, the value in creating a partnership with this community and our Women and Worth platform. We're also joined again today by a team of high school and college age girls from ETRA, which is a program started by Alana Rea that offers mentorship and aims to inspire confidence in young women to stay true to what they really love. Um, these bright, ambitious young women are joining us this week as correspondents. They're writing up daily recaps. You can see the first one on worth.com today uh, about what they're learning each day. Uh, so before we jump in, uh, I'd love you to be as participative as possible. Please do use the chat function. Please use the Q&A. Uh, we love to see your comments and questions throughout the day and we'll certainly weave those in uh, or give you the opportunity to ask questions to speakers directly um, so don't be shy. Mm -hmm. 